Hello and welcome to this Property Minder tutorial on contact management within the toolkit of your Property Minder website. In this video, you will get tips on how to better manage your contact list, including information on how to add a new contact or create a new group. To get started, log into your Property Minder toolkit. From your home screen, the first link in the middle of the page is the Client Relationship Management hyperlink. This will bring you to your contact list. First, we will go over how to create a new contact. At the top of the page, find the button that says New Contact. Select which group or category you would like to add your contact into. For this example, we'll use Buyers. There are only two required fields to add a new contact, and those are the last name of the contact and their email address. You can add any other information you would like, such as company information or job title, address, birthdays, or any other confidential notes. It's very simple to use. After you're done inputting data, make sure you go to the bottom of the page and click Save. Next, we will show you how to add a new group. Creating a group is very simple as well. Just click the Groups button at the top of the page, and then click the orange Create New Group button. This will take you to a screen that will let you name your new group and drag over any existing contacts you have to be included in that group. If you have a number of contacts that are stored in another database, such as Microsoft Outlook, we make it very easy to transfer them into your toolkit. If you have any questions or need more help with importing your contacts, please contact us to set up a one-on-one -on -one training and we will walk you through the steps and any trouble you may have. Our toll-free 1-800 number will always be on the bottom of your toolkit, which will connect you directly with our technical support. You can also manage each individual client already in your database by clicking on their name in the contact matrix, which will bring you to their contact card. You can then edit information by clicking the Edit Contact button, as well as a few other options, such as the Action Log button, which brings up a list of all email communications sent to this client. You can also view all actions they have taken on your website with the Client Tracker button, or use the Edit Follow-up link to set up campaign follow-ups for events such as birthdays or other significant events. This outlines the Client Relationship Management section of your toolkit. As always, if you have any questions or need help, please contact our technical support team and they will do their best to answer your individual questions. Thank you and have a great day.